Nola Jet here at Vincent's Italian Cuisine. Good stuff in here, yeah! Welcome to Nola Jet. Let the good times roll. In this episode of our New Orleans Travel Vlog, we visit Vincent's Italian Cuisine for our restaurant review videos to experience their fantastic New Orleans Italian food. Vincent's is located in the Uptown area of New Orleans at 7839 St. Charles Avenue, which is about 15 minutes and 6 miles away from the French Quarter. This New Orleans Italian restaurant is noted for their great lunch and dinner specials and is very popular for their delicious Southern Italian food. We continue our best food quest as first we feast with me through the New Orleans restaurants for the best New Orleans food at the best New Orleans restaurants. In our restaurant review videos, we show you the best food New Orleans has inside New Orleans best restaurants. New Orleans has a lot of great food and Vincent's has definitely been among my New Orleans favorite Italian restaurant options for many years that we will show you in this visit with our restaurant review videos. The only negative thing I can say about Vincent's Italian is all of the parking is street parking in this area, so it can be challenging to find a spot at certain times and especially during dinner service. Fortunately, you're right here on the St. Charles Avenue streetcar line, so you can always hop on one of the streetcars and hop off right here in front of the restaurant, or you can generally find a parking spot. You just might have to walk a bit further to the restaurant as you'll have to park a bit further away. But we're going to be having both a lunch service and a dinner service here, so you can see how very different it looks inside and outside with those two experiences. So let's go ahead and head on inside and check this place out. And so immediately when you walk in, you see the New Orleans decorated mat, which so many of the restaurants have. And you can see it's a uh, decent sized restaurant inside of here. There's the bar area right now with fewer chairs than normal due to the COVID-19 situation. There's a men's bathroom right there on the left. We have another dining room right here, and there is wine all over the walls and almost every room. So this is quite an Italian place. There's another little space back here that we'll check out too, and another bathroom right there we just walked past. So they have a little smaller room here that goes back to some more spaces back there. And then we'll walk back through, and now we're going back past the bar. There's the kitchen door right there. And here's the other dining room in this area. So more wine on the walls. So a nice cozy space in this area. And then here is more of the dining room space right here. And that is the front door that we walked in initially right there. So it's not a huge place, but it is a comfortable, cozy spot. And I really do enjoy this place. They have such great food and lunch is always a very easy time to get in here. Dinner time can be a lot more crazy and crowded as you will see soon enough. Vincent's has also been awarded the best Italian restaurant many times in New Orleans and you can see some of their awards on the wall right there. You also can get a free martini for lunch which I am indulging in right now. Commander's Palace and a few other New Orleans restaurants do offer 25 cent martinis for lunch, but this is the only free one that I know about. So if you like free things too, go ahead and destroy that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and comment below. And while you're down there, check out my Patreon account information because hey, I work for tips and it really would help me if you could join my program and support the channel and also share this video with any of your contacts because all that really would help me with the YouTube algorithm. Well, let's check out the menu. So we have lunch specials with a panko crusted flounder, herb crusted salmon, black and red fish, veal tagatella, stuffed merlton, beef tips marsala, veal napoleon, homemade lasagna, crab cake, calamari bordelaise, veal St. Charles, seafood medallions, chicken marsala alfredo, and chicken carbonara. Then we have our dinner specials with appetizers, baked crab claws, arasini balls, homemade crab meat ravioli, stuffed merlton, and we have our entrees of panko crusted flounder, a tuna, crab meat au gratin, stuffed moltons, rosemary chicken, jumbo shrimp and crab meat fra diablo, shrimp taglatelli, veal taglatelli, roasted half duck, veal napoleon, black and pork chop, veal chop, and 
Doc Carbonara. Then we have the amazing Taste of Vincent's, a six course meal, which not getting that today. There's a lot of food, a lot of great choices. This is a great option when you're really hungry. Then we have a great selection of appetizers, a great selection of soups, and a choice of many salads. Then a wonderful selection of pastas with the house specialty cannelloni. And then we have a nice selection of seafood and chicken dishes. And then we have a selection of meat and veal dishes and our wines by the glass. So I started my lunch with a salad with the house Italian dressing. They also have a really great house blue cheese vinaigrette that's great to get as well. So, mmm, this tomato looks really fresh and fantastic. Ooh, I really do love the salad dressings here. This has a lot of flavor to it. It's always a very pleasant salad to have. These are probably among my favorite starter salads at any restaurants just because I love their dressings here so much and the flavors just really explode and give you a lot of pleasant sensations in your flavor sensors on all your taste buds. So it's definitely a fun time in here to start your meal off with a good salad. The soups are also really special here. They have some really great selections on those items. So you can almost make a meal off the salads and the soups if you're not super hungry. But we're going to eat more than that. And hey, go ahead and destroy the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up like we destroyed this wonderful salad. And I really would appreciate it. For my entrees, I got the seafood medallions. This is handmade medallions of eggplant layered with jumbo lump crab meat and topped with a seafood cream sauce with Louisiana crawfish tails and Louisiana shrimp. It looks fantastic and smells even better. Oh, look at these beautiful shrimp on here. Oh, yes. So nice. Oh, and the flavor is fantastic. So much great stuff in here. Now we're going to slice into this eggplant medallion here and combine it with a little bit of the seafood. We have a shrimp on here, some crawfish, and ooh, a little crab meat. Oh, all of that goes together really nicely. I'm a big fan of this dish. This is so good. Oh my goodness, there's so much seafood in here. This is definitely a feast. I have enjoyed this a whole lot. This was a fantastic lunch. Ooh, so many good flavors going on in here. It is crawfish season in New Orleans, so oh, oh, that always makes for more fun seafood. Oh, there's so much good flavor in here. Good to the last bite. Just like I destroyed that. Oh, it was so tasty. Go ahead and destroy the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up, and I really would appreciate it. And refer this video to any of your friends that would like it, and that all really helps me. But look, I have more food to eat, too. This is the side dish that came with it. It's more pasta with some kind of a stuffing here. Ooh. So, I'm not even sure what all is in here other than it's all deliciousness. Ooh. So some kind of a seafood dressing here. Oh, such good stuff in here. They're making sure that I'm not going to leave hungry today. This is definitely deliciousness on top of deliciousness. So, oh. How fantastic just the side dish was. Good stuff. They take such great care of you in here. Amazing. So, just like I destroyed this dish, go ahead and destroy that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. Refer this video to any of your contacts that would enjoy it. Especially if they enjoy seeing wonderful seafood dishes like this. So, the total for lunch was $27.49 before tip. And now we're going back in for dinner. It's a totally different experience. Where you been? It's my pal, the big boy, and this place is packed. And we're meeting for a fantastic dinner in here. But wow, we're having to wait at the bar while they get our table ready. This is a really exciting night. We're about to have a lot of good food in here. And so we started out with some breadsticks and this wonderful butter right here. Ooh, Big Boy really loves these breadsticks. They also make some great toasted garlic bread here and their corn crab bisque served in a bread bowl. Take the lid off. You know what, 
Just a like a mama used to make. But get deep and get some of the bread. The corn crab bisque in the bread bowl really is one of the signature items here that you really have to try if you've never had it. And then I got the Italian chicken vegetable soup. This is the uh, Italian Best chicken soup, it, right? Italian chicken soup's got a lot of vegetables. Keeps me strong and healthy. It's very nice. So destroy that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, share this video with any of your contacts who would like it, and comment below. And now it's salad time. How do you like your salad there? This Italian vinaigrette just brings out the Roman in me. I, I just feel like I'm um, living in the boot. Living in the toe of the boot. Vini, vini, vici. So my dining companions got a stuffed Merlton, and then they also got a Seafood Diablo. So a lot of great options on here. And then I got the house specialty, the cannelloni. Yes. Yo, this food is to go. Let's tell them to bring us some uh, French bread or whatever kind of bread they got. Ooh, cannelloni. Yeah. Mm. This is survival. Tasting it out. What do you think? Amazing. Excellent. This is crazy, right? Like simple. Yeah. Mm. So the cannelloni has a lot of great flavor, there's two sauces, there's plenty of nice tender veal inside, and lots of ooey gooey cheese to add to the goodness. This is some of the best food I've ever had. Oh my god. The entire table is very pleased with the food and they just really go above and beyond here with producing some fantastic and amazing Italian food. All the way down to this last little delicious bite here. Oh, I'm sad to see it go. It's been so good. So just like I destroyed that cannelloni, destroy that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, comment below, and share this video with any of your contacts that would like it. So the big boy has already been feasting. So the big boy's been so taking, we're taking it down already. Some of the bread bowl, and we're dipping it in the uh, shrimp and crab Diablo sauce. I think it looks pretty good. So the bill total came out to one hundred and twenty-seven dollars and twelve cents before tip, which for four people is actually a pretty good deal. And everybody was really pleased with their food, and everybody had a fantastic time. So thanks so much to everybody at Vincent's Italian Cuisine for such wonderful food and so many years of enjoyable, great times. And thanks to all of you out there for tuning in and watching the Nola Gent channel, especially to my Patreons. And make sure that you destroy that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, comment below, and check out my Patreon account while you're down there because, hey, I do work for tips, and I really do appreciate it. And tune in next time for more good food, good times, and good people. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you would just click on the little circle here with a picture of my head in there and subscribe to the Nola Jet channel, it would really help me a lot. I really appreciate it. Thank you.